Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and Wellington and Alex. And today we have a Dollar Tree haul for you. I'm in the middle of filming a vlog. No, I didn't change my shirt. And I'm a wet brown rat. I've been out running errands in the rain, but I wanted to get this Dollar Tree haul filled for you. I'm a little weird today. Is that better? Yes. All right, so let's get to it. No particular order. I will show you what I found. Okay, please tell me this is not fantastic. It is a deer holding a wine glass. I'm gonna use this on my charcuterie board to probably hold like toothpicks or spoons or something because I've gotta find where I put the ones for my board. But this is so fun. It's a deer wine glass, I love it. So I grabbed just one because that's all I need. Um, I grabbed a pepper grinder and somewhere in here is a salt grinder to go to the Christmas cabin. These are great just to travel with. So I grabbed one of those. Oh, ooh, and I found this and it's so exciting. This is a new find. It's a bulb with an S in it because, you know, I'm obsessed. But look at it, it's so pretty. And it's decor, it's glass, plaster, ceramic. How fun is that? And they had all different initials, but I got the S and I think that'll be so pretty just to sit out somewhere. You know, S from Lori or for Santa. I don't know. And this is not a big bo a big haul. I picked up some snacks. So Sarah, my niece, and her friend are going away after Thanksgiving. And then I'm, I'm going to watch the dog. So I'm going to make them some little goodie bags for their road trip. So I got them some Boom Chicka Pop. One sweet salty kettle and one white cheddar. And I figured they can share. So I grabbed one of each. And now that these are a nice size bag, they are 2.25 ounces. Certified gluten kosher. I'm learning this from watching Melissa Strauss and a couple haulers. This is kosher. If you eat kosher. Now this is just you kosher. This is, oh, you dairy. I learned, I learned that. You in the circle with the D means it's kosher dairy. There you go, if you're kosher. Excuse me, sir. Um, and then I picked up thinking I was going to give this to him, but I'll tell you in a second why I'm not. But I grabbed two of these big Reese, I mean Reese, uh, Rice Krispie Treats with M&Ms. These, um, I can't give them because there's gelatin in it and they're both vegetarian. So I'll put these on my goodie board for my family or take it give it to my brother. One of my brothers will want it. Not a big deal. Um, at my st one store, they're still putting out new Thanksgiving and I know other people have hauled, but I haven't seen. And it's these really pretty pumpkins. These are the tra uh, rub off transfers. I'll just keep them for next year. Put them with my Thanksgiving craft stuff or fall stuff. But I liked these, I thought I loved the color and I thought they were super pretty. So even though I'm moving on to Christmas soon, if I see something that they put out for fall or Thanksgiving or something, I'll use it. I'll just put it away for next year. Um, I grabbed two more of these. I like that they're just plain white cups um, with the black lid and the star, uh, corrugated cardboard. So I grabbed two more and I think I have another one, but I use them for my coffee bar. I use them when I have get togethers or family comes over. We're gonna use them at Christmas for our coffee bar. And then I have that party coming up on the 11th with my work folks. And I do have a, a sleeve of other cups, but these are the backups. So I grabbed those and I'll leave them in my like party bin or my get together bin because I think they're great and I love using them. Especially when I um, go to work at my part-time job, if I don't stop and get Starbucks or something, I can brew my own at home and take it and then I can just toss the cup. I don't use them at home, but I do use them for travel. Um, I haven't been buying a lot of gift bags because I don't really need them for myself, but oh, is this not everything? I love the teal color. So I grabbed these for the girls. This is what I'm gonna put their little travel snacky things in uh, because I got a couple other things. And if you saw my vlog yesterday, you would have seen 
these are in action because I'm gonna, I have filled them up. But I grabbed one that says deck the halls and this one matches my bathroom. And it says tis the season and I love these bags and I love the colors. And they just both have some snowflakes. Super fun, super pretty. And so what I'll do is fill up We'll do our thumbnail. Alex, you're on, no, you're licking yourself. <laughs> Him's taking a bath. Hey, excuse me, sir. We're on video here. He doesn't care. That's all right, we'll ignore him. So I grabbed these two bags for the girls. And also for the girls, I found these facial rollers that you stick in the freezer. So I thought I would also give them some beauty stuff like these facial rollers and I have a couple masks. So I can give them some masks. And this is used chilled for a cooling massage. You put it in the fridge or freezer and then you rub it over your face and it helps with redness, swelling, acne, all sorts of stuff. So I grabbed one for each of the girls and just a little treat for them to have on their little getaway. Okay. He's, he's done digging at himself now. Okay, look what I found guys, Nutrigrain bars. Like what? This is named brand. And there are eight bars in here. Three strawberry, three apple, and two mixed berry. What? For one shiny dollar. Now, what is the good through date? Because I thought I looked at it. So these are good till December 31st, but I'm sending them with the girls on their trip. So I'll just throw these in one of the two bags or split them up between them. And then they have some Nutri-Grain bars and whatever they don't eat, they can take home. But they're going to be gone for several days, so I thought that would be fantastic. I grabbed a pack of these. These are floating candles. I was looking for them last year, and my store ran out and didn't get them back for until now. But um, you could take, like, a bowl of water, and you put this candle in it, and it floats and burns. And I thought they were super fun. I mean, obviously I'm not having parties and stuff, but someday I will again, right? Right, someday I'll be able to have people at my house again. But I think these are super fun, especially for like New Year's Eve party or just put them somewhere, you know, fun. So I grabbed them to put in with my other candles. I don't have a plan for them right now, but I knew I wanted them. Uh, here is a new item. I think there's a secondary one. Let me see if I can find the other one. I did find it, okay. I have not seen these before. These are hooks. And these are the two colors I got. They also had a brown. So I got this one, which is antique white finish. It is a grain briar. It even comes with the little screws. And I'm thinking these are gonna go on my patio to hang plants on. You could use them to hang keys. And then this one is antique blue finish. And I love this teal. And they could go in your bathroom. You could hang towels from these. I mean, they have a substantial hook. And they're metal. I mean, they're definitely metal and they're pretty sturdy. That you could hang something on these. How fun are those? And then they have like a beigey one, but I didn't need that one. But of the five stores that I go to, I only found these at one of my stores so far. So yeah, I grabbed one of each color. Definitely could use them. I just don't know where I'm gonna hang them yet. Um, but I'm thinking, like I said, on my patio to maybe hang hanging plants or something of that nature because I love the colors and I think they would be super fun out there. So I grabbed that. I found one more of the Diet Cranberries, so I just grabbed it. I love this juice. I love this brand and I love that there's only two carbohydrates. And what is the sugar? So it's filtered water, cranberry juice concentrate, acid, pectin, natural sucralose. So it's Splenda that is in here to um, sweeten it. And after tomorrow, I will have a continuous blood glucose monitor. So tomorrow's Monday and I'll be able to see how it affects my blood sugar because right now I'm just not sticking myself 30 times a day. So we'll do it. But I grabbed one more of the Diet Cranberry. And I, because I don't know what the good through date is on these. It doesn't say. And if it does, I'm just not seeing it. And I don't really, oh, here it might be up here. I'm looking guys. If this is it, it's 22, 
2022. I don't know though, because that it doesn't look like a date. I'm not sure, but I won't hold on to them too long anyway. So I'm not going to worry about it, but it's fantastic. Now I picked up one of these. Um, this is just the basswood or pine or something. It doesn't say I'm getting, or I have received and I haven't done the, the review yet, but a company reached out and sent me a laser cutter that will burn into wood or cut wood or burn or etch glass and metal. It's a laser engraver. So they sent it to me to try out and I wanted to make a sign if I can figure out how to work it for somebody for Christmas. So I grabbed this and we're gonna put a sign on it and then I'll put like a hanging thing on the back so they can hang it. But I thought this was great wood pieces just to practice on, but I have to open it up and get it a video. Then I found two of these. Literally my store had two of the sugar cookies with Santa belt. Um, these are a Merry Cookies decorated cookies. I have no idea what they taste like. Um, Deco cookies. I don't know. They're just a sugar cookie. I'm assuming they're supposed to be like a Cheryl's cookies. But I got these for the girls' bags as well for treat to have. for their, They have a long drive both directions. So I grabbed those for the girls, each of them. I say girls, guys, they're 30. They don't need me buying stuff for them, but I want to. And so they're okay with that. Okay. I found, finally, the um, isopropyl alcohol, but the 70%. And I do need the 70 for some crafting that I'm doing. Um, so I grabbed a bottle just to clean things. I have some 50 and it's okay, but um, I know the 70 kills it, bacteria, but I don't, that's not what I need it. I need it for crafting. And this is a 16 ounce bottle, which should be fine for me, right? So some crafty stuff. Oh, here's the salt. And this is sea salt that I got. So just a little salt and pepper fun to take, but I love a, a fresh grind and, you know, we'll be there for four days. So I'll need salt and pepper. So I grabbed those to pack up in my food hamper. I found one more of these and I thought I would grab it. I know it says Christmas house, but really you can use these year round. And um, it's the one with the green boxwood. And then you put I think it's over here or down in there. You put your AA batteries, two of them. So I grabbed one more just to have. And then look at this tissue paper. Do I need more tissue paper? No, no, I don't. But do I want it? Yes. And look at the stripes, the red on red. I thought this was perfect. And you get 10 sheets and I do have some clothes I need to wrap. So I will always need tissue paper for that. And sometimes, well, not sometimes. When I wrap up my ornaments from my tree, I wrap them in tissue paper. Now I typically will buy a big pack of white um, because I wrap the glass in tissue paper. But I thought this was perfect for gift packaging. Oh, I think I just have one more thing left in this haul. I grabbed these. So Sarah and I, and you will have already seen this if you watched yesterday, but we're doing um, Thanksgiving evening. We're just going to do some little crafty stuff. So I picked up a bunch of little crafts for us to do. And this was one of them. It's air dry clay. And we're going to make a penguin. How cute is that? I just think these are adorable. And there are directions on the back, but it also links you to a website or a YouTube channel. Um, yeah, there's a video you can watch. And this is imported... Oh, it is imported by Greenbrier. So this is a Greenbrier product, so you should all be able to find them at your stores, but it is air dry clay. I'm oh, so excited. So I got this one, and I think in my other haul, I got us a different one, but. So guys, that is it for today's haul. I'm not finding a ton of stuff that I need or want, or that is new, um, but I am seeing at my stores a lot of um, boxes of unpacked stuff, so I'm sure that it, they'll get it on the shelves as soon as they can, and we'll go back and we'll find it then. But for now, that is everything, and if I don't see you before then, have a happy Thanksgiving, and I will talk with y'all later. Bye!